and children because of that. After the war, look what Christ So he quoted this, and I love this. I want to share with you. He says, It is not the critic who counts. The critic, it doesn't count. It is not the one who points out how the strong man stumbled. The one who said, oh, That man who is strong, he has fallen down. It doesn't matter. Or how the doer of this might have done them better. Somebody who says, Oh, I could have done what he did better than what that man did. Oh, ask this one. Those people don't matter. The credit, the person that the credit belongs to, is the man who is actually in the arena. He's making his hands dirty. He's inside. He's inside. Bending his back and doing all kinds of things. This is the arena. The man whose face is being slashed or marred with the sweat and dust that he is confronting. If he feels sweat and dust has made his face look ugly. That one. The man whose face and mud and dust and blood, and dust and blood, who strives valiantly, he tries, who makes mistakes, errs, and comes up short. He makes mistakes and comes up short again and again. The man who does that, the man who knows the great enthusiasm, he is consumed with passion to do what he is doing, though his face is full of sweat, his face is bad, he is this, but he is consumed. The great devotions and spends himself in the worthy cause, and who at best knows the triumphs of high achievement, and who at worst, even if he fails, at least falls, fails while daring greatly to his place, so that his place shall never be with those people standing outside who are cold and timid. No who go nothing, neither victory nor defeat. The law that shall confirm is that if you are inside and you are doing something and you are making mistakes, getting the hell love, you are the one who deserves it. And not those people standing there saying, look, he didn't do it well. It's like, and that person standing there, he hasn't done anything, he hasn't accomplished anything in his life. That's not the person we listen to. We listen to those who have their hands at it. So, all of you, students struggling to pass the exams, <clears throat> professors trying to steer the university, the London supporting us, faculty members, me, good facilitators for us students. Don't feel bad if some people standing outside who have done nothing tell you you are failures. Just keep on doing the best that you can. And with this, I want to end. My one hour, uh, I think this one, but I talk to you. Right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, and I have a feeling for you. Yeah. I have a feeling, still you are tired, I have a feeling. Who that you give me a chance to interact with you. I like young people, I like teasing young people to get the best out of them to come. I don't Pampire young people when they make a mistake. I scream at them with love. I scream at young people with love. Because I learned some time back that if you want to do any correction of anybody, you must correct with love. And that's what I try to do. And I'm leaving that as my very, very final last comment. Thank you so much for listening to me. And I hope that when you go out there, there's something small that I said that what we you can work with, especially with the fingers, finger the same. If somebody asks you to do fingers, you tell them you want to be a right man. Or don't put dice in your head because you go into your, your skin. Those things are just advice. As a case, that we also Thank you, Mr. President.